Namaste yoga friends, my name is Doreen Foxwell. Welcome to today's video that is in honor of Breast Cancer Month this October. I know this is a little bit late coming in. We're halfway through the month almost, or we are halfway through the month. I can't even think of what the date is. Well, yeah, we're halfway through the month plus. But I wanted to share something for breast cancer awareness and breast cancer health. And when we do all teen girl classes there and Girl Scout troops too, we introduce them to a pose that can help for breast health. And you basically make fists and you go around your breast tapping gently to keep the lymph nodes healthy. And so you can do it um, for a short time, a couple times, a little bit longer. Women should do this too, definitely women. And this is specifically for breast health. And uh, during Breast Cancer Awareness, we wanna play, pay homage um, to two very, very important women in um, my life. My mother, who is a breast cancer survivor now of oh, over 15 years, and to Miss Emily, who is one of our business partners, franchise owners, and she also is a breast cancer survivor. And both women are two of the strongest women I know. They both have battled this um, deadly disease and they have come out on the other side. And actually both women wound up battling cancer a second time um, recently, both of them recently, but it wasn't breast cancer this time. Apparently, what I never knew, is that breast cancer can cause other cancers in the body later on. And that's exactly what happened uh, to both of these women in my life and who mean a lot to me, but they're still here. They're still fighting. Um, they've still overcome it twice. And uh, breast cancer, it has a very special place and meaning um, in our business. So if you or anyone you know is battling this and you would like to reach out to us, we are happy to do a uh, pro bono or a class for them. Um, specifically, it could be more meditation or relaxation, which is very, very important when somebody's going through breast cancer. Um, or it could be a typical yoga class for them. But just reach out to us, let us know. It would probably be virtual because we have students in uh, three or four different states. And so uh, to commit to them would be a little challenging, but virtually we could get to anybody. And that is our uh, October uh, gift to you that if you or anyone you know is going through it and would like either a mini class, a regular class, you know, we would be happy to do that for you out of uh, homage to the two very special women um, that are a part of our lives. And so to all of you mothers, sisters, aunts, cousins, grandmothers that may be suffering from this terrible disease, we send out prayers for your health we send out love and one of the things i have in front of me are pink crystals pink for me and for the world signifies uh breast cancer the pink ribbons and um the color pink is the highest level of the heart chakra for those of you that study chakras the heart is actually a green uh wheel but for breast cancer and the highest form of love, the highest form of the heart chakra is actually pink. So it fits accordingly because your heart is housed right there between your two breasts. So I think we wish you all a beautiful remainder of Breast Cancer Month. Namaste.
Have a great yoga day.